Hey, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. And good morning to all my students. Okay, today we are going to continue our what we call discussion or lecture for topic 5, function and graphs. <coughs> and <coughs> today it's time for us to discuss on 5.2 composite functions. So I do hope that all of you are ready with your lecture notes in your hand right now. And without wasting so much time, let's continue. Okay, so in this in this video, we're going to we call represent the student should be able to represent a composite function using an arrow diagram, find the composite function, and find one of the function when the composite and the other functions are given. <coughs> so let's say given to you a function of fx and gx. So they want you to find what is the fun composite function of f gx g fx or might be g square or g gx okay and then find one of the function when the composite and the other functions are given for example when they give you a function of fx and g fx <clears throat> so they want you to find out what is the function of gx okay so composite function of <coughs> f not g and g not f compose, consider two function of f and g composite function of f and g is written as an f g or f not g and is defined as this one here okay and please take note that f g x okay f g x is not equal to f multiplied with the function of g x Okay, this is multiplication and this is composite function. Two different, uh, we call dif different techniques. Okay, <clears throat> so let's say there is an x, the domain of x here, and when substitute into the function of <clears throat> of g, then we get the function of g x, and when we substitute the g x into the function of f then we get f g x okay so class actually that the composite function here is we substitute the function of g substitute the function of g into an x of the function f okay <coughs> so now if if f x equal to 3 x plus 1 and gx equal to 2 minus x. Okay, we like to find the first one here where a f gx. Okay, right. First, we write down the function of g where g is 2 minus x. And then composite function is a process where we substitute the function of g into an x of the function f so in this case for function fx equal to 3x plus 1 3x plus 1 and here we substitute the function with the function of g which is 2 minus x <clears throat> so then 3 times 2 equal to 6 3 times negative x minus 3x plus 1 then 6 plus 1 equal to 7 minus 3x. <clears throat> okay. And B, G, F, X. Okay. Question B, G, F, X. The same process. Write down the function of F, X first where F, X equal to 3x plus 1. Then, we substitute the function of f into an x of the function g, where it is the uh, function of g is 2 minus x. So, substitute x with 3x plus 1. Expand and simplify this to negative times 3x minus 3x, negative times positive 1 minus 1. So, 2 minus 1 equal to 1 minus 3x. Okay, and next, for C, we have F, 
g and fx. So find out this first. <coughs> mm, okay. In this case, if you like, if I can recall, find the composite of this first. G not f. Where we have G not f, G not f we have in question of B. Okay, G not fx. So then f here <coughs> composite with g not f and g not fx g not fx equal to 1 minus 3x 1 minus 3x and substitute this into an x of the function f here which is 3x plus 1 so 3 times uh, 1 minus 3x so 3 times 1 equal to 3 3 times negative 3x minus 9x plus 1 3 plus 1 equal to 4 minus 9x <coughs> okay okay so okay so now class let's compare between this fgx and g not fx where these two the result of these two are different uh, fgx and g fx they are not equal according to this is 7 minus 3x and here is 1 minus 3x <coughs> Okay, so now example two. Um, okay, I'll try to make it all here. So fx equal to one minus x, gx equal to x square minus three, and hx equal to two divided by x. So firstly, find fgx. fgx f g where g equal to x square minus 3 and substitute this x square minus 3 into an x of the function f guys girls uh, sometimes they give you a function something like this f x equal to 2 x minus 1 and g x equal to x square minus 2 x plus 1 so when we have g f x okay f x equal to 2 x minus 1 so substitute f x into an x of the function g so in this example okay this is my own example there are two x's there for g where we have x square and x here so just imagine that if we have if we substitute the f into this and x here square okay. <clears throat> okay. minus 2x plus 1 okay I said it again <coughs> we substitute the function of fx f into an x of the function g so how many x do we have then here one two so then two x minus one and two x minus one okay so now back to the question here substitute g into an x of this one minus x where x squared minus three okay so we have here, uh, what we have here right now is 1, negative, x squared, negative, negative, become positive, 3. So 1 plus 3 equal to 4 minus x squared. <coughs> okay, so I think that I'm going to, what do you call, uh, move to the next slide for this uh, A to H example here.
Okay, I will write the question after this. For this example, given that fx equal to 1 minus x If 1 minus x, g equal to x square minus 3 and hx equal to 2 divided by x. Okay, solution for question A. Solution for question A, uh, we call it, we call it, I solve it here. So you can just copy it up from here now. Let's Continue with question we call example B. Example B, G not Fx. Okay, so G, Fx equal to 1 minus X. So then substitute this into an X of the function G. 1 minus X square minus 3. Okay, so expand this simplified. 1 minus 2X plus X square minus 3. So it is x square minus 2x minus 2, negative 3 plus 1 equal to negative 2. C, G, not Hx. <coughs> and G, Hx equal to 3 over x. And substitute 3 over x into an x of the function G, which is 3 over x square minus 3. Okay, 3 squared equal to 9 over x squared minus 3. And for this one here, 9 minus 3 x squared divided by x squared. Okay. Example D, H not GX. Okay, so GX equal to x squared minus 3. And substitute this into an x of the function H. It is 2 divided by x square minus 3. <coughs> okay, question E. F not Hx. So Hx, it is 2 over x. And substitute this, all this into an x of the function f, which is 1 minus x. And substitute with 2 over x here. Okay, so <coughs> uh, it is x minus 2 divided by x. Okay, so now f. Exam example f. Example f. We have h not fx. So h fx equal to fx equal to 1 minus x and h is 2 divided by x so 2 divided by 1 minus x okay f g example g we have f g h x okay first Okay, hx equal to 2 over x. Substitute hx 2 over x into an x of the function g. So f, then it is 2 over x square minus 3. Okay, <coughs> so simplify the one inside this first is pos if possible. Then you come up with 4 over x squared minus 3 or f uh, 4 minus 3 x squared divided by x squared. Then, then substitute all this into an x of the function f, which is 1 minus x. It is now 1 minus 4 minus 3 x squared divided by x squared. Okay, <coughs> change this in the form of the denominator uh, fraction of x squared divided by x squared. 
So now it becomes x squared minus negative 4, negative, negative, positive, 3x squared divided by x squared, 4x squared plus 3x squared, 4x squared minus 4 divided by x squared. Okay. It's any form as long as, uh, what you call, uh, in, in the simplest format. Okay. For G, so question of H, you try by yourself. Okay. Now, example 3, if given fx, if given that gx and gfx equal to 3x plus 2. Okay, so now, given that gx equal to x minus 1 and gfx equal to 3 plus 2x. Okay, class. gx equal to x minus 1 and gfx equal to uh, 3 plus 2x. Okay, class. I did mention to all of you just now, earlier, that the process of g not fx, where we substitute, substitute the fx into an x of the function g. Again, we substitute the fx inside into an x of the function g. So then, for this one here, gfx <coughs> So meaning that, just imagine that we have recall for this g f x substitute f x into n x of the function g. So just imagine that if I substitute this x with f x, which is f x minus one. Okay. Uh, again, the function we call composite function of g f x is where we substitute the fx, the function of fx, into an x of the function g. So g fx is a substitute the fx here, okay, into an x of the function g, so now become fx minus 1. And g fx given here is 3 plus 2x. So then, fx equal to 3 plus 2. 2x, negative 1, bring to the side, become positive, plus 1. So, 3 plus 1 equal to 4 plus 2x. That's it. Okay. Okay, now, <coughs> given that gx, if find gx, okay, find gx, if given fx here, and gfx equal to x squared plus 2x plus 2. Class, example 4 and example 3. What's the difference between these two examples then? What's the difference between these two examples? Yes. For example 3, we like to find the function, well, we like to find the function that inside, okay, g, f, x, okay, we like to find the function inside of this composite function. That, but then, for example, 4 from g f x, okay, from g f x, the f x inside is given here. f x inside is given here. But we like to find out what is the function of g, which is outside of this composite function. Can you, can you spot the difference now? Okay, just now for example 3 and example 4, both in the form of g f x. Okay. okay, both in the form of g, g not f x. Example 3, uh, they give you, they, they give us the composite function of g f x and the function of g. We like to find out what is the function of fx inside. But for example 4, they give you a function of g fx and the function fx. We like to find out what is the function of g outside. Okay, so in this case, fx equal to 
x plus 1 and g fx equal to x square plus 2x plus 2. Okay, so now, <clears throat> okay, and definition of composite of g not f is where we substitute the function of fx, okay, substitute the function of fx into an x of the function g. Okay, now, and the function of fx equal to x plus 1, x plus 1. Substitute x plus 1 into an x of the function g, but we have no idea what is the, what is the function of gx right now. So, g fx, g not fx equal to, okay, g not fx as given here, which is x square plus 2x plus 2. Okay, so let's take this one here as a let it as a u. u equal to x plus 1. Okay, and from here we make as they make, we make this as a uh, what do you call equation as an x equal to bring one to the other side become negative x equal to u minus one. Okay, so now let's rewrite this here. G f x equal to x plus one and x plus one equal to u g u. And from u equal to x plus 1, we have made, we call make equation of x equal to u minus 1. <clears throat> and we're going to substitute this here and here. Okay, x, x, so x square, then here is u minus 1 square plus 2, u minus 1 plus 2. Okay, so then expand this, u square minus 2 u plus 1 plus 2 times u and minus 2 plus 2. Okay, 2 times negative 1 equal to negative 2 plus 2 here. So then, what's left here now? 2u minus 2u. So now it become u square plus 1. Okay, so gx equal to uh, gx equal to x square plus 1 gx equal to x square plus 1 okay so class uh, I'd like to make some we call extra addition of what we call explanation on this part here okay so for example like for example let's say we have found out the gx where fx equal to fx equal to x plus 1 and gx equal to uh, x square plus 1. Okay, so let's, okay, let's find out f g, let's say x equal to 1. Okay, meaning when x equal to 1, Class, you may do in two different techniques. Okay, you may do in two different techniques. The first techniques is you find out what is fgx first. Find out what is fgx first and then substitute the value of x equal to 1. Then you will get the final answer. Or second option here is, uh, let's say... Okay, I'll make the first option just as, as I mentioned just now. F gx, gx equal to uh, x square plus 1 and substitute this into an x of the function f. So then substitute here x with x square plus 1, you get x square plus 1 plus 1. So then x square plus 2. So if f g1 then just substitute 1 here, 1 square plus 2 equal to 3. Okay, or another option, the same question here, 
fg1. So substitute 1 into a function into an x of the function g directly. Okay, what is the function of g just now? g equal to x square plus 1. So substitute x equal to 1 here, which is 1 square plus 1 equal to 1 square is 1 plus 1 equal to 2. Then substitute 2 into an x of the function f where function of f is x plus 1. Substitute with x plus 1 or 2 plus 1. We also will give you equal to 3. So 2, we call, uh, is it actually that the recall 1 correct answer, what we, but with two different techniques. Okay, so for this one, okay, for this one is an additional from me. Because from all the examples, there is no example. Because from all these examples, there's none of the example that when they uh, re substitute the value of x with any numbers or values. So I add up with one of these, substitute x equal to 1. Okay, with two different techniques. Firstly, we find out the complete composite function of fgx, then substitute the value, or straightly we substitute the value of x uh, in the process of the composite function. Okay, this is an additional for me. So guys, class, uh, the conclusion is the composite function of f g x f not g is not equal to g not f. So that's all for today. Thank you very much, and I do hope that this video will help you in your studies and revision. So that's all. Thanks again. Uh, we'll meet again in the next series of videos. Uh, till then. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and have a nice day.